Follow your passion first. Um, you know, when I retired from the game, you know, I sat there asking kind of all the wrong questions. You know, what's the biggest industry I can get into? And it's all the wrong stuff. And you got to sit there and ask yourself, okay, what am I truly passionate about? What do I enjoy doing? And when you feel that way, I, honestly, I mean, you feel like you have never worked a day in your life. It's the most fun thing in the world. You get up in the morning excited about what you're doing. And you got to be really honest with yourself about it. If you wake up in the morning and you're dreading going to work, dude, do something else. Right. Do something else. And those are hard decisions to make. But when you make those decisions, it's a very liberating experience. And you find out that the rewards will come. What's poppin' guys? Welcome to another video. I am back again here on this very very somber week um man it's january 30th and uh as you all know this past sunday we lost a legend uh himself kobe bryant passed away sunday in a terrible helicopter uh helicopter crash it was him and his daughter and also a coach and his wife and his family and um yeah, it's, it's, it's a very somber week. So forgive me if I am a little bit uh, very unenergetic today. Only because Kobe Bryant meant a lot to me. He meant a lot to a lot of people. Um, he was just, you know, he was, he was a person to look up to. Uh, and one of the things that he's always said is that, you know, what, what inspires me about him is that he always said the idea of being a great leader is to inspire others to be better um and i think kobe bryant definitely did that he inspired everybody to be better um so yeah we definitely lost a legend it's been tough for everyone um and not that the other passengers aren't important because they are just as important especially especially his young daughter and the two other women that were on the plane and the other passengers it's a lot um yeah <laughs> welcome to 2020 but without uh you know diving too deep into the sadness of everything um i just want to bring it back maybe let's uh you know say rest in peace to kobe bryant but also let's let's also take this time to to, to reflect on our lives and to, and to you know cherish the moments that we do have here um, but let's jump straight into this reaction video. This reaction video is another reaction video uh, to the Kings. Uh, this is their cut performance. I'm super excited. Anytime I think about the Kings, they just like they they light up my world, man. Because these guys are so dope. Uh, so yeah, let's jump straight into it. The Kings, the cut. Let's get to the cut. Okay. Okay, let's stop there. Let's stop for a moment there. That was sick in of it of itself. He came through with multiple backflips as his teammates did kip ups as he came along into a rolling ocean, and then he went into a walk over walkman walk over at the end. And the amount of air he got is just unreal. Like I've Man, I rarely ever see things like that. Okay. Ooh. Night. Okay. All right. All right. Here we go with the animations again. So not only did he just beat kill all of those beats. Da 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 da. Like, hoo, hoo, hoo. he's hitting every beat, but then he hit him with the animation, and it looks like his hand is actually reaching through his teammate. But actually, what's happening here, guys, I'm going to show you a secret. All he's doing is putting one hand behind his back, like this, and the other guy's punching in towards him. So, that's what the illusion is. But, I sorry, I'm giving, giving away this king's secret, but it's really dope when you can pull it off that quickly. Let's jump straight back into it. Nice roll here. Kip up. So let's dissect that for a moment. I can't dissect this pig, Mr. Kingman. It's against my religion. So jumping right back into it, man, that was sick. It was like as he was running, they were creating the evolution of man or something like in air. Um, that was that was dope. 
I don't know what's going on with my camera. Stuff is happening. Batteries dying. Whatever. Let's jump back into this. So they just did something incredibly dope. They just created like this massive robot thing. Like it's so dope. And they use their legs as the leg of the robot. Like that's dope. <laughs> The kings are the kings. Once again, they ended the dance with the flip and they caught him spread eagle like it was nothing. Like, absolutely nothing. What a dope performance. Way to build consist consistency because they just consistently had amazing performances, amazing stunts. There's so much, there's not a moment in their dance where you're not engaged. Um, throughout this entire dance, they had, they had animation they had bollywood they had regular hip-hop they had some footwork going on there like if everything was just to the t and they pulled it off flawlessly but that's it for today's video guys not a whole lot going on just gonna talk about that one that was the cut kings you what an amazing job i would love to come train with you guys or, or anything like that so if you ever got if you guys ever see this hit your boy up you know, whatever, let me be a king too. I mean, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a different kind of king, you know. Um, but anyway, see you guys in the next video.